Swing out on the crane, coming up. Lander on deck. Roger, lander on deck. Anything in there? I'm not sure. Get it into the light and have a look. I see an amphipod. You see an amphipod? Yeah. It's Paralacella. Ah. She's beautiful. I'm Jenny. I'm a PhD student at the University of Western Australia. I'm on the boat basically to help sort the amphipods from the Nova Canton Trough. The amphipods are really interesting. They are some of the only animals on the planet that can reach full ocean depth. So this is really interesting for studying things like their physiology. We've got a giant amphipod that's come up from 4,000 meters. It's usually we only catch a couple of trips, so when we do get one, it's really exciting. A lot of amphipods are specialized to the Hadal zone, so 6,000 meters and below but you'll find species across the globe. So it's really interesting to think about how they occur in multiple Hadal zones when you don't find them on the abyssal plains in between. It's a really nice example. Out of all of the Hadal amphipod species, they have the most well-developed eye. And people have tried in the past to work out if they're able to see light, but we still don't know. So I'm gonna try and work that out as one of the chapters of my PhD. We've collected samples from 3,000 meters all the way down to 8,000 meters, which has never been done before. We found a couple of potentially new species, one that I'm actually in the process of describing already. So we've been able to get a really nice overview of the amphipod community in the Nova Canton Trough. I'm happy. It was the last amphipod I needed for my PhD. 